Hey you all, I'm Joe, and welcome back to the Cyborg Apocalypse. We almost have our little enclosure built up here, and I think we're safe from the rhinos. Hopefully. Joe, buddy, focus. Focus, bud. I need you to just do nothing but make some blocks right fast. Food situation, we're all over that now. I think we're good to go for quite a while. We got a good amount of herbs coming in, although this is really going to, you know, amp up our wealth. And I'm not super stoked about it, but at the same time, this is definitely something that I want to have around. And there it is, the unending march. Ooh. So this is all melee. Let me go back into that again. Where was it at? Messages. Uh, they will prepare and then they will attack. So that means we're going to be doing some cutting, y'all. Whoa. Let's slow it down a bit here. All right, this is great. This is an opportunity right here because this is plasteel. This is components. This is perfect. Thankfully, like I said, you know, we can do a little bit of catting and it looks like their AI isn't all that great either. Back it up a bit. We'll just kind of play ring around the rosy here for a little bit. Getting some damage in on these guys. Having those two slowed down is going to be a great help to us. Oh, we got one of them killed it already. And now they're beginning their assault. Let's back it on up. The good thing about the unended march is generally they are all melee units. So we have a much easier time dealing with them. Without having a without a kill a proper kill box or anything like that. Which wow, it's been so long since I've played without the embossers mod that I'm not hundred percent sure I even remember how to build a proper kill box. I don't know how much these things deteriorate while they're outside, but luckily everybody just grabbed them went. All right, we got the enclosure built now, so we can start worrying about a few other things. Let's maybe start patching up a bunch of holes that we have in the base here. We'll drop that there. We'll go back, we'll reset this up like we were before, and then we'll kind of sort of maybe, I don't know, maybe we can come in here like this. Actually, let's cancel that. We'll do like a little, we'll do a few temporary plugs. I wonder if this will be better just to come straight across right there and not worry about here so much. I think straight across might be the best bet. Which, I don't know. Let me, let me see here. We come up to there. Yeah, let's do it like this. Just like that. I mean, that ain't going to stop anybody any like sappers or anything like that but it will to some degree let us funnel i'm st ooh ooh that's ooh that's a massive amount of ducks 14 ducks mother trucker okay okay so we're gonna have to cat that's that's the thing we're gonna have to do and it looks like the ducks don't have anything to do with this oh that's good that's good the less we have to worry about shooting at the better all right, let's back it up. Might be a horrible place to cap from. <laughs> I can't believe we get... Oh, man, the shooting practice, though. I was, you know, that's that old saying. Shooting ducks in a barrel? No, maybe it's shooting fish in a barrel. But this is pretty much the same thing. I was worried for a second, you all. I was worried. This was a lot of ducks. So I was I was a little scared of what was what might have happened. But that was, that was interesting. Okay, let's get back up to super speed here. Ah, okay, so we can close off there, close off there. Should I put the freaking kill box here and not worry about it being over there? Because over here we can kind of go down like this, maybe. Maybe put a door in there too, just to have, you know, little, little extra ways in and out of the place. Speaking of extra ways in and out of places, let's go ahead and do this. Is that number right there? We'll not worry about that one so much we'll keep it sealed off you know what yeah put in the, put in a kill box in right here probably wouldn't be that bad of an idea going to planning and we are having a party okay so i want to start with a wall segment four five six seven eight I should be fine for now. This part right here will be kind of whatever they're called, the little barriers. I forget their names already. 
So I want something like this, and then now I want something like this. So then we can kind of maybe come up like that, give or take. Be a little further up for now. Uh, we can go just like this, and we'll clean that out like that. Now this should be fine. I don't... <sighs> I'm worried. I'm worried. Whenever I deviate from plans, bad things usually happen. Condensing the base wouldn't necessarily be a bad idea either. Don't really want a metric ton of space. And the power, you know, hmm. We'll go, we'll go with it like it is. Should be fine. All right, let's see what Randy gave us here. Anything good? Oop, that was the wrong button. But luckily we have allow all. Uh, we didn't really need any of that right now, but that's fine. You know what? One thing, one thing. I want to get some storage going right fast. Make it out of slate. Do we even have any slate? Uh, dang it. Uh, let's jump in here. Let me switch this around for just a minute. I don't even know what that minute's going to be like, but we'll do this right fast. Set this back up to wood. That was the original plan. And we'll get these slate food baskets. Is here good? Yeah, that's definitely good. A new quest has come available. A mech cluster of 2x size would deploy nearby. And then that's that's an automatic no. Mm -mm. Cannot be handling no mech clusters right now. Okay, so we have this sort of semi-sealed in a fairly okay if ish way i probably should have stayed with everything being pretty far out you know what you know what let's cancel that let's bring it up one more all right this i think will work out a little better where is security and where is the barricades i'll toss a couple barricades in here perfect Man, doing kill boxes without using embossers is, well, wow, it's it's definitely, definitely not something I'm used to doing. That's for sure. All right, I want to go like that, but over here, do I want it over here? Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Where's a door at? Let me grab one. I will put a door in just like that. And I might even put a door, two doors in there. We can put maybe some 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 blah 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 some curita stuff in there. Uh, but I want this going just like that. Actually, you know what? This is a no go. Here would be better. Actually, no. Just like that would be fine. Oh, uh, what can I put there? Should I use spike traps? They take forever and a day to build. These are quicker to maintain. So if I go like that, and then I come over here, and I put one of these there, and one of these there. This should be semi-decent for right now. Well, uh, let's get this built. Actually, you know what? One thing I should probably do is expand the home zone. Right into that, just like that. Let me go ahead, and let's get rid of this. This was all in preparation of, of building this gigantic area up here. And we don't want to have to deal with any of the nonsensical problems that that's going to cause later on. Uh, just like so. I'm going to have to clean this up a little bit more, I know. But I won't have to worry about it too much right now. Alright, you can go away. All right, now let's re-expand everything back out. I was just, I went a little too quickly and then I decided to just go with it. All right, that will all get repaired. You will get repaired eventually. All right, let's snatch this up too while we're at it. And here, is that good? That put all of our things inside the home zone. I'll probably grab up both of those while in case at some point we go out to repair. Batteries are low. Oh, we had another Z event. That's fantastic. Conley, you're already fixing it. Good. 
fixing it. Nin, 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 nin. Randy decided to toss a heat wave our way. You know, super thoughtful he is. How's that going to affect everything? And it's going to get really hot in those two rooms. Yeah, this is exactly why I kept those three fans in there for now. I really would have liked to have gotten rid of them, though. Let me look at her wealth. I pushed the right button. Ah, uh, yeah, we just can't. I'm horrible at wealth management, y'all. That's not something I was never good at. But Joe, I really need you to crank those granite blocks out as fast as possible, boo. I feel a lot better once we get this little kind of temporary thing set up up here. Although, I'm not 100% sure how well this is going to work out. But this should be fine. I hope. I would really, really wish we had some heavy SMGs. Oh man, that would make life so much better, wouldn't it? SMGs just makes everything better. I totally forgot to snatch up those those melee weapons there. One of the things about not having embossers is that you don't, you can't really form a melee kill zone. Because they, they'll come in and they'll go around the embossers while you're still able to shoot at them. So since we don't have that mod and we're doing it kind of a more of a traditional way. They're going to come and cross over these barricades. And that's not something we want to have to deal with right now. So one of the things that we're going to use to prevent that is everybody's going to have a melee sidearm. I'm really starting to worry you all. Because listen to me, Randy, he is not a kind man. And he will come down upon us like raging hellfire. And it has just been a little too peaceful. Although, yeah, it's been a little too peaceful. I'm I'm worried. I'm worried. I want to get this. This needs to be built as soon as possible. Joe, what are you exactly doing? Okay, you are you are going off, way off and hauling stuff. Good good to go, bud. Good to go. Eden's Drifters. Let me let's check this out. Okay, so three desperate refugees are approaching. Their leader is Eden. They will they escape from a slave caravan. Eden begs you to stay at Pumpfield for 19 days. In return, they will offer to work and fight for free during that time. If you make them happy, some of them may offer to join you. These refugees, part of no faction. Uh, you know what? You know what? I'm probably going to regret this. Not exactly sure. Well, I could fill this whole area up with just potatoes right here. It's all potatoes all the time. Ah, uh, you know what? You know what? Do I do it? Do I do it? I do. I do do the do to doing it. Go ahead and let's prep for this with a little bit of outdoor furniture, sleeping spots. Having these folks right here, this could be, this could turn out, or it could turn horribly bad. Some of these folks are underhanded. Oh, look at you, buddy. Look at you, a tier one android. Oh, son. Let me go ahead and set all this up. You know, right off bat, Eden here. I really want Eden. So to make Eden happier than most, Eden is getting this bed right here and i really hope these people aren't backstabbing death mongers because i'd really be super happy if they join the cause that cause being the continuation of my survival let me go back through here oh look at this you are also really good at doing all the things also aren't you uh joe where you at right here let me just pop you in like that you're not going to worry about hunting or constructing for now Although you might, but you can grow. We'll have you in growing. Put you on plant cutting just like that. Oh, son, I want all of these peoples. Well, I really hope this crew stays. I want, I want Eden and I want, how do you spell that? Sean? Seen? Sean? I don't know. I want the robot and I want Eden. Those two for definites. Uh, Conley, why don't you come over here and prioritize working on that ceiling fan? We want Eden to be as happy as possible, as often as possible. Because now 
we can double up on that research, y'all. Eden is such a good little tune, man. I'll prioritize working on you. Let me go back into super speed. And then we got freaking Sean over here. I think that's how you say that, right? Is that Sean? Sh I think it's Sean. I don't know. I might rename you to, to bot or something. Uh, but yeah, we got two people. We can double up on that research now. Microelectronics is going to come along super fast. Uh, let me look back in here again. I really didn't do a whole lot. You are basically going to be a clone of Joe. Crafting and all that. That means we can get another one of these going as well. Uh, where is Conley? Conley, come build that right fast for me, good buddy. Perfect. And then I will come over here and then let's just do a little copy paste. Yep, we'll flip the bills around. Copy you. Woo, too many pastes. All right, so we'll do slate, granite, granite, slate. Perfect. We do have some tattered apparel though. Hopefully y'all come up here and do what you need to do. But they're super not going to be happy about all those dead bodies, huh? Well, all right, all right. I can, I can, I can accept that for now. Let's go in here and do a little bit of do forever. Uh, let's clear all. No, let's clear all. We'll allow rotten and fresh. And not animal corpses, only human corpses. We'll allow everything. Uh, you robot guy, you will uh, prioritize burning at the pit. We can't put you on battery use yet, though. But that blah blah blah. But we'll get to that. Super, super stoked about this, y'all. But I really gotta, I really gotta fix these 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 minor breaks, though. Uh, once we get rid of the dead bodies, that's gonna help out a ton. But I think that's gonna do it for this episode, y'all. This helped out a lot. This is super helpful right now. Really gonna amp up that freaking uh, wealth, though. I'm pretty sure we jumped through the roof. Take a look at it here. Uh, it didn't go up too bad. Not that bad. But all right, y'all. As always, winnings out, crowbar out.